So, um, I've been a week for the last 90 minutes. I really want to get on. So, let's get on. to draw every day. It's just, I'm not very disciplined, so. Um, I have to draw every day or I forget. Who knows how much. So I will keep it on daily practice. Same stretch as yesterday, just looking at it from from the last shot I was just cut off, looking back towards the nose rather than the works at one of these bars. I don't know which one it is. Um, my nephew likes going to him for a haircut. I don't really like people touching me. So. <laughs> I, I have a haircut, um, but I just go to the place that's closest. the actual market. Strike work exhibited no well it'll be this weekend by the time the video comes out. Um, at the Great Northern Contemporary Craft Fair, which this year is somewhere. Where are we? 
Victoria of Baths, Manchester. So if you're in the area, um, look for Antisocial. They're exhibiting my work there. I won't be there personally. Um, eight cars, I don't think I can travel that far. Uh, I travelled to Preston and I'm back yesterday. Um, uh, it didn't do my back any favours. And ironically, that was to see a doctor about my back. So I have the people coming to pick up the work tomorrow to go to the show in Manchester. So despite the fact my back's hurting, I'm going to have to go work in the pottery to get it organised today. So when they come tomorrow, it doesn't look quite so much like hell. No, it's, it's not that bad, I just want it to look. There's still stuff in boxes, but I want it to look kind of almost ready, sort of thing, to be welcoming people to come and have a look around. And we're uh, nowhere near that stage. It's. It's been a journey. Let's put it that way. It doesn't help when I only have so much time. I can work and stuff because my back hurts. I really is my back hurts right now because I'm not been moving around enough. Yesterday it hurt because I had been moving around. <laughs> Structured. 
Wow, there you are. Turn the turtle on the highway back in the tree. Is this made? Why is it not draw a club? <laughs> experience of kind of having my own businesses every time I feel like I'm at the edge of completely giving up or something comes along Those things don't always work out, they always come up, but something always comes It's the hundreds of plants that sit out the front of here. Um, I just. It would push me. Uh, but I just. I should do. Yeah, but I don't want to do it. So I'm not.
are they? Right. I found everything. Thought I'd click record. Hadn't done right. Sorry, I am rather congested today. It's making it hard to breathe. Yeah, apart from, you know, we need to spend some time on battery, so. Afraid to commit to just one thing, I guess. And then I like doing multiple things. I want to have a portfolio career. We do more than one thing. It's like when I wanted to declare that I was just going to work on one thing. It just I came to that sort of clarity that it might be easier just to do art and not to do pottery. Uh, I just spent a lot of money right up there. Now I'm a bit like, I'd, I'd use it either way, it's just, yeah. I thought about going down to one thing last year. But I, like I say, I still enjoy It's not a massive money spinner. <laughs> Maybe if I was making the right thing, it would be. Um, we're going to do some experimentation towards that, see if we can make the pottery profitable. Paint, Joseph, paint. Stop worrying, paint. You've got 
too much to be doing to be worrying about choosing things like that. to think about what to do and if I spent less time worrying more time doing I'd get more done <sighs> weirdly I didn't worry about stuff and I just did it just saying just saying Just saying, if you didn't, you know, just worry all the time and just made stuff. You make stuff. Oh. Anyway, painting or how I learned to off the bomb. Um, anyway, thanks for watching. Um, back tomorrow. Uh, lots to think about, lots to do. Bye.